The internet can be a breeding ground for fear and fascination alike. One minute you're scrolling through memes and cat videos enjoying the light-hearted content, the next, you're staring at a photo that chills you to the bone, making you question reality. This is the story of one such image, an image that has haunted the minds of many. A trail camera, hidden deep in the woods, captures a figure that defies explanation. It's a blurry figure but undeniably human-shaped, adding to the eerie mystery. Its pale form stands out against the darkness like a phantom emerging from the shadows, sending shivers down your spine. The photo spreads like wildfire, igniting curiosity and fear in equal measure. People are captivated, terrified, and desperate for answers, unable to look away. Is it a hoax, a lost hiker, or something more sinister lurking in the woods? The image is shared countless times, appearing on websites and forums dedicated to the paranormal, sparking endless debates. Speculation runs rampant as the photo takes on a life of its own, becoming an internet legend that refuses to fade. But behind the viral sensation lies a mystery that deepens with every passing day. Where did this photo come from? Who was behind the camera and what were they trying to capture? Who or what is this ghostly figure? Is it a spirit, a trick of the light, or something else entirely? The answers, it seems, are shrouded in darkness, much like the image itself, leaving us with more questions than answers. As the internet continues to speculate, the legend of the ghostly image grows, feeding our fascination with the unknown. And so, the mystery endures, a haunting reminder of how the digital age can amplify our deepest fears and curiosities. The internet, while a source of the mystery, also becomes a tool for solving it. A reverse image search is launched, hoping to uncover the photo's origins. Sites like TinEye and Google Images become digital detectives, scouring the vast expanse of the web. The search leads down a rabbit hole of paranormal blogs and forums. The image is everywhere, often accompanied by sensationalized headlines. Scariest trail cam photo ever, screams one website. Proof of ghosts caught on camera, asks another. But concrete information remains elusive. No one seems to know where the photo came from or who took it. The trail runs cold, leaving us with more questions than answers. The mystery deepens, pulling us further into its web. The mention of a slave cemetery sends shivers down the spine, evoking a deep sense of sorrow and reflection. It speaks of a painful past, of lives lost and forgotten, buried beneath the weight of history and neglect. The history of slavery in America is a dark and brutal one filled with untold stories and lingering sorrow, each grave a silent witness to the suffering endured. Research into Liberty, Texas reveals a tragic truth, a chapter of history that many would prefer to forget. The cemetery located near FM 563 and CR 140 is gone, its existence wiped away. It was bulldozed in the 1960s, erased from existence by an act of callous disregard, a decision that still haunts the community. The identities of those buried there lost to time, their stories untold, their lives unremembered. An 84-year-old man, Warren de Blanc, shared his story in a 2010 affidavit, a testament to the enduring pain of this loss. He spoke of his mother, laid to rest in that cemetery, her final resting place now a memory. He spoke of the pain of being denied access to her grave, of the injustice of her memory being desecrated, a wound that time has not healed. His words echo the grief of many, a reminder of the past that still lingers. The Cemetery That Vanished The slave cemetery, once a place of solemn remembrance, is now an empty field. This place which once held the memories and stories of countless lives, now stands as a barren landscape, devoid of any visible history. No headstones remain, no markers to indicate the lives lost and the stories buried there. The ground, once hallowed, now offers no clues to the past it once held. It's as if the earth itself has swallowed up the past, leaving behind an eerie silence. The wind whispers through the overgrown grass, carrying with it the secrets of those who once rested here. Even Google Maps with its all-seeing eye cannot pinpoint the exact location. The satellite images show nothing but an empty field, a blank canvas where history has been erased. The cemetery's erasure is complete, a chilling reminder of how easily history can be swept away. The stories of those who were buried here are now lost to time, their memories fading into the ether. The ghostly figure in the photos takes on a new meaning. It stands as a spectral reminder of the lives that were once commemorated here. Is it a restless spirit, disturbed by the desecration of its final resting place? Or perhaps it is a manifestation of the collective memory, refusing to be forgotten. The connection between the photos and the cemetery is undeniable. 
the spectral images seem to bridge the gap between the past and the present, a haunting reminder of what once was. But is it a causal connection? Could these apparitions be the spirits of those who were buried here, or are they simply figments of our imagination? Or is it merely a coincidence, a trick of the mind seeking patterns in the chaos? Our brains are wired to find meaning, even in the most random of occurrences. The mystery, like the cemetery itself, remains buried beneath layers of time and speculation. The truth may never be fully uncovered, leaving us to ponder the stories that have been lost to history. Searching for a ghost in Liberty. The investigation now leads to Liberty, Texas. The town becomes a focal point, a place where past and present collide, the goal to find the exact location where Chu took his photo. Armed with a map and a sense of purpose, the search begins. Every twist and turn in the road, every abandoned building, every overgrown field, could hold a clue. The energy of the place is palpable, a heavy silence hanging in the air. But the search proves fruitless. The landscape has changed in the years since Chu's photo. Nature, it seems, has reclaimed what was taken, further obscuring the past. The ghostly figure remains elusive, its presence felt but never fully grasped. Unanswered questions linger. The mystery of the ghost girl in the trail camera photo persists. Despite our best efforts, the truth remains elusive. Who or what is this figure? Is it connected to the tragic history of the slave cemetery? Some might dismiss the photos as hoaxes. Others might see them as definitive proof of the paranormal. But without concrete evidence, we are left in a state of uncertainty. The lack of answers is frustrating, but it is also a reminder of the limitations of our understanding. There are some things in this world that defy explanation, that challenge our perception of reality. The allure of the unknown. The human mind is naturally drawn to the unknown. We crave explanations, seeking order in a world that often feels chaotic. It's this innate curiosity that fuels our fascination with mysteries, both real and imagined. The ghostly figure in the photos taps into this primal fear. It represents the unknown, the things that go bump in the night. It reminds us of our own mortality, of the mysteries that lie beyond the veil of life. But the allure of the unknown is not just about fear, it's also about wonder, about the possibility that there's more to this world than meets the eye. Respecting the past, seeking the truth. The search for answers should never come at the expense of respect for the past. The erasure of the slave cemetery is a stark reminder of the injustices faced by marginalized communities. As we seek to unravel the mystery of the ghostly figure, we must also remember the human cost of history. The lost lives, the forgotten stories, the pain that continues to echo through generations. The pursuit of truth requires sensitivity and empathy. It's not just about finding answers, but about understanding the context in which those answers exist. A call for authenticity. In this age of digital manipulation, it's easy to fake a ghost photo. Photoshop, filters, and special effects can create convincing illusions. But that doesn't mean every unexplained image is a hoax. There's a danger in dismissing everything paranormal as fake. It closes us off to the possibility that there might be more to this world than we can explain. Instead of immediately crying fake, we should approach such mysteries with a healthy dose of skepticism and an open mind. The mystery remains. The ghostly figure in the trail camera photo remains an enigma. It's a mystery that continues to captivate and intrigue, a reminder that some questions may never have definitive answers, but perhaps that's okay. Perhaps the true value of a mystery lies not in the solution, but in the journey itself. The search for answers can lead us down unexpected paths, forcing us to confront our own beliefs and biases. And so, the mystery of the ghost girl in the trail camera photo endures a testament to the enduring power of the unknown.